Hey guys, let's talk about how you can connect your HY300 projector to a phone without remote control. As you can see here, I have my phone. That's an Android device and I can control just using the buttons here. You see back there, I can go there and control everything. I can just come back home and it works pretty fine. Okay, super simple. I'm controlling everything from here. So basically, you need to use a mouse, let's say this one, for example. I'll leave the link here in the description, or you can get yours if you have one. It's a Bluetooth mouse, and here you see that I have a dongle, okay? So I can just connect a dongle here, and it starts working right away. You don't need to do anything else. It's just working with the mouse, so you can use the mouse to control the screen. See here that I have a cursor back there, and I can come here to settings, and Bluetooth, and from here I can search the uh, Bluetooth devices, just enable Bluetooth as well. You see here that I have the Galaxy S8 Plus. Let me just unpair this one. So we'll see from scratch how it works. So it's not paired anymore. Then I come here to my device as well. Here I have the app. I'm gonna show you later which app I'm using here. Let me just come here first to the screen and go to the Bluetooth. And from here, I can just check the devices that I have. See here that I have available devices, the HY300 Pro. That's because I have the screen back there looking for devices. It's ready for connection, okay? It's, it's searchable. So my projector is searchable. Then I find it here and I just uh, tap on it and wait for it to connect. So it's pairing right now. There we go, I just need to confirm. There we go, I hear a chime from the projector. And I, when I come here, you see that's paired, okay? And back there on the screen, you see again, that's paired here with the Galaxy S8 Plus. So I'm good to go, okay? And by the way, with the mouse, when you just right click, it comes back, okay? So if you need to come back, just right click. So it's working with the mouse right now, but now I can also use the remote control using an app. As long as I have connected here with uh, the Bluetooth, I come here and I'm gonna use this app. You're gonna find this one here, just uh, using, let me just come here, on the Play Store and look for this one. Just look for Bluetooth and remote mouse. That's uh, the developer, okay? So just make sure that you find this one. Just tap here, Bluetooth, remote and mouse. And I'm gonna find it, okay? Then it just install this one, open it up. And the first time that you open it up, you're gonna see here the option to connect. In here, a list of the devices. So the, the app scans the network and finds all devices available here via Bluetooth, including the HY300. So I just select this one, hit connect, and it starts working. Just Use it. There we go. Back there, you see, it's working. Back home. And you can even use as a mouse. Here, see, see here, air mouse. When you select here, then you do this. It works like an air mouse. It's pretty interesting. Good, right? Super, super good. We just disconnect this. Then you can even control the volume back there. Let me just show here that I'm just uh, using here the volume button. And I can just hold and it's lower, lowering the volume down. And here it goes up. You can mute and unmute. Come back. Super, super good. Okay. But guys, it's working with my Android device, but it also works with uh, iPhone. I have another video here in the channel showing how to connect a projector with the iPhone as well, okay? So I'm just doing this with the Android device because otherwise the video is going to be too long. For you guys that use Android, that's the way you can connect your HY300 projector to your phone without a remote. And then you can replace your remote. You can go to Amazon, for example, and get a near remote control. Okay, so I hope that helps. Please subscribe to this channel.
Leave your thumbs up here and your comments, and I see you in the next video.